guys. Today I'm going to make another Super Bowl Sunday snack, um, the pretzel bites. Alicia had made pretzels the other day and she had gotten the recipe from a gal's blog on Pinterest. And if you've never looked at Pinterest, I suggest that you do. And um, so I'm going to link this video to the blog and you could get your ingredients there. You could get your directions on how to make the dough, how to make the pretzel. And I'm just going to go from the dough stage and show you how to do the rest of what I'm going to do with the recipe. So take a look. Okay. And the recipe says to cut it into ropes because then you would make it into regular pretzels, which I'm not making regular pretzels. I'm just going to take these and then cut them into small pieces because I just want the little bite-sized pieces. Okay. And so after you do that, you're going to put them in a baking soda wash and there's the instructions also on the blog to do that. And what this wash does, it gives it that brown skin on the outside of the pretzels. Okay, so you're just gonna put it in that wash and you're gonna put it on your baking sheet. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna make a few different, different pretzels here all at the same time. So of course, I'm gonna use a little bit of coarse salt on some of them. Okay, so we'll just put some coarse salt on some. I'm gonna use some Italian seasoning. What I did was just took some garlic powder, garlic salt, little bit of Italian seasoning. I'm going to put that on some of them. Taco seasoning mix, chili powder, a little bit of cumin, a little bit of garlic powder, a little bit of salt. That'll be on some other ones. So you have like four different pretzels all out of the same shot. Another um, Parmesan cheese, Italian seasoning, basil, um, parsley, and we'll put that on. A little bit of cinnamon sugar on the last ones. And when these come out, we're going to put a little bit of butter on them. And that'll be just the icing on the cake. Okay, so these are going to go into a 450 degree oven, cook for about 10 minutes, and then I'll take them out and we'll take a look at them. So while those are in the oven, I just wanted to mention I have several other Super Bowl um, recipe ideas. There's one for white chicken chili. There's another for Texas caviar. Another for a caramel snack mix, um, there's a chili recipe, and there's also a fruit salsa recipe that is just really, really good. And a touchdown taco dip, which is perfect for Super Bowl. Okay, so when they come out, you want to um, brush them with melted butter. And I'm really not really even touching the bread because I have so many different spices, I don't want them to mix. And there you go. So I plated them. Very, very yummy. So we have Italian pretzels here. We have cinnamon sugar pretzels here. We have some uh, Mexican spicy pretzels here. And then some Parmesan and garlic ones in the middle. So you can make all of the same kind. You could make, you know, you could double this recipe and make a whole bunch. But they're just the perfect size. And, you know, they're just yummy. So we'll give one a shot. I would say that these could be trouble. So I hope you like my little twist and uh, the pretzels. So enjoy and we'll see ya.